So, the next thing to happen on Friday Night Smackdown, we got the first match of the night. But before I talk about that match, there's a few things to talk about. So, before the match even started, we had Kofi Kingston and Xavier Woods at the New Day come out. And the New Day was talking about how they are, how they was the longest reigning WWE Tag Team Champions. And how it looks like the Usos are going to try to surpass that, but they ain't going to let them and stuff like that. So, yeah, that's what the New Day was saying. But then we get to a backstage segment with uh, Sami Zayn and Solo Sokoa. Sami Zayn's talking to Solo, but then uh, Jey Uso comes up and um, he talks about how he couldn't find Jimmy or whatever. So yeah, Jimmy ain't around. And uh, Sami was like, um, well, tonight me and you is going to coexist because we're going to keep Solo back here. So you can focus on his match, but you better not screw up like you did on Monday and stuff like that. And then while they was going bickering back and forth, uh, Roman Reigns called uh, Sami Zayn's phone, Sami answers it, and then he passes the phone over to Jay Uso, and then Jay was talking to him, and he goes like, yeah, alright, cool, I understand. And then he gives the phone back to Sami, and then Sami starts laughing what Roman said, and then Jay Uso's like, oh, what did he say? And then Sami was like, it's an inside joke, you don't need to know. <laughs> so yeah, and then he hangs up the phone, and they go out for the match. So yeah, it was Sami Zayn with one half of the undisputed WWE Tag Team Champions, Jay Uso versus Kofi Kingston with Xavier Woods at ringside. So yeah, one-on-one -on -one match between Sami Zayn and Kofi Kingston. It was a pretty good match. Go check it out if you haven't yet. Really good match. The kickoff SmackDown back and forth and stuff. At one point, we see Jay Uso hitting a super kick on the Xavier Woods outside of the ring. It uh, distracted Kofi Kingston. And then uh, Sami comes up from behind him, hitting a blue thunder bomb, almost getting three count, but. Kofi barely kicking out at two, and that was wild, but then there was one moment where it was like botched or whatever, where Sammy throws Kofi into the corner, Kofi climbs up that top turnbuckle and jumps off, and I think he was trying to do like a Sinton or Hurricane Rana, but uh, he completely misses, and Sammy was trying to hurry up and fix that situation, try to roll him up for a pain and stuff, so yeah, it was quick thinking by Sammy for a little botch, but it, it didn't ruin the match or anything, it just happened, you know? But yeah, like I said, it was going back and forth and stuff. And then at one point in the ending, uh, Sammy, uh, Jey Uso got on the apron. Uh, Kofi was trying to knock him off the apron, but then Sammy rolls him up, getting a two count. And then we get to the ending when we see Kofi Kingston trying to hit the trouble in paradise. Sammy ducks, but then Sammy grabs him for like the blue thunder bomb or whatever, try to hit it a second time. But then Sam, and then Kofi reverses it by rolling him up for a pin, getting a count one, two. Jay Uso comes in there, pretty much kicking Kofi in the chest, pretty much to kick him back over, so Sammy can roll him back over for a pin, getting the three count the referee didn't see it. So yeah, Sami Zayn defeated Kofi Kingston tonight on SmackDown. That's what happened. Really good match to kick off SmackDown. I'll give that match three stars. That's why I'll give it. Pretty good match. But then after the match ended, we get to another segment backstage where we see Triple H talking to some cops and stuff. You know, telling him about whatever. And then all of a sudden, Ray Mysterio comes up. And Ray was talking about how he can't do it anymore. How he don't want to face his son. And, you know, how it's complicated over there on Raw and stuff like that. And he wants to tell Triple H face-to-face -face that he wants to quit WWE because of that. And Triple H was like, no, don't do that, Ray. Um, just give me five minutes of your time. Let's go to my office. Give me five minutes of your time. And let's go ahead and talk about another uh, another way. So yeah, that's what Triple H said, and both of them walked in the office. But yeah, that's what happened there. Pretty good stuff, though. So yeah, I'll see you guys later until the next thing that happens on Friday Night Smackdown. See you guys later until then.